Hi everyone, welcome to BISP Solutions. This is Farha Alam, and in this tutorial series, we are basically uh, learning about uh, the inbound integration tool in the HCM Cloud. So today we are going to take a look at the business object uh, structure. So as in order to understand uh, what HDL is capable of, it is very important for us to understand the business object structure because HDL loads business objects and uh, they all are different in nature. So we have to understand each and every objects we have in our uh, HCM cloud. So here, <clears throat> here is about the business object. Basically, business objects are referred to as objects that support bulk loading capabilities. So with the help of uh, business objects, we can load bulk data in our uh, Oracle HCM cloud. Uh, we can use HDL for bulk loading of business object. So uh, earlier we had discussed that uh, we have different utilities available in order to load the data in the HCM cloud. So uh, business objects support both the utilities like uh, either we can go with uh, the HDL that is human capital management data loader or we can load our business object with uh, uh, SDL that is a spreadsheet data loader. We'll come to that point uh, also. So basically uh, right now we are uh, looking for the HDL uh, capability. So uh, in order to uh, load the data in the HCM cloud, we are basically uh, working with HDL. So here is the available uh, objects we have in the uh, HCM cloud. That is, we have grades, job, location, position, department, organization, worker, etc. So these are basically the business objects. So firstly, we have to load the grades in our uh, <coughs> HCM cloud. We have to load these objects. Firstly, we have to load the grade, job, location, position, department, or, and then only we'll be able to load the worker data. As uh, <coughs> in order to load the worker, we have to load these uh, previous objects first. So today we are going to see how can we load the grade business objects in our HCM cloud. So here, firstly, take a look on the uh, grade object basically grade business objects. So grades are created to record the level of uh, compensation for workers. So uh, whatever compensation is provided to the worker basically based on the grade. So it is but obvious that we have to uh, define the grades first only then we'll be able to hire the employee in our organization. You can create grades for multiple pay components such as salary bonus and overtime rates. These are basically the examples for the grades. Uh, and then we have we, we can define one or more grades that are uh, uh, applicable for jobs and positions. So uh, depending on uh, the abilities of the worker, we can uh, uh, define we can define the grades in the organization. And depending on the capabilities of the worker, we can assign the grades to the worker. So in order to uh, load the grades in our HCM cloud, we have to go to the instance and see. So in order to understand how can we load the grid object in our HCM cloud, we have to move to our instance first. So let me go to the instance. Here is my instance home page where I have logged in as the username with Curtis PT. And in order to load the data, uh, what uh, uh, Basically, we require we require uh, a dead file and we have to uh, compress or zip that dead file. <coughs> and then we can uh, load uh, the dead dead file in our HCM cloud as uh, HDL only supports the dead file and it must be zipped as well. So here I had created my dead file. This is basically my dead file where I, uh, we have discussed all these things like metadata merge, what all these things. So here is my dead file. Dead file is nothing but a, a pipe delimited file. 
and I have saved it with dot date extension. We have to save this file as dot date extension and then we have to zip it or compress it. You just have to right click on the file and then click on compress to zip so that file has got zip. Now we have to move to our instance and this is our home instance home page. We just have to go to this my client group option. Either we can go with the springboard options available and we can go with the navigator option as well. Here is uh, my client group and here is the option called data exchange. We can click on it. <coughs> and here we have all the inbound outbound uh, utilities available. So here we are focusing on the inbound. So I'm just going to click on this uh, HCM uh, data loader and under it, I will click on import and load data as I'm going to uh, load the <coughs> grade object, grade business object in my uh, HCM cloud instance. So here these are basically the previously loaded objects. So in order to load new business object, we just have to click on this import file option. Click on it and then we have to uh, search for the file which we have created and zip that. So here is my dead file. This is my file basically. And I, this is my dead file and I have zipped it, compressed it. So I'm just going to select it, click on. So here we can see our file has appeared over here, grid.zip. You can see the extension for this one is .zip. And then click on submit now. We get one confirmation message that our file has been submitted. Click on OK and then click on this refresh button. Here we can see our file has been uh, appeared over here, but the import, but the import status is still in progress. So we just have to keep on uh, refreshing this button in order to get the success message for this one. So here after refreshing we can uh, see the import status has got success but the load status is still not processed so keep on refreshing. Now it is in progress status. Here. The load status is also done over here. We get the success message for this one. Load success is 100. Total objects is 5. We can check for this one. So here we have basically 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 rows. So import status is also showing. We have loaded the 5 business object. We can see over here like 5. Now the next step is just to go to the instance home page and under this setting and action button or profile icon go to the setup and maintenance option and under this global search bar global search panel search for manage grades search for this one and here we can see manage grade click on it and then search for the grade like we can search our grade either with its name or its grade code individual contributor so give it a name over here individual contributor search for it so here we can see all the uh, individual uh, contributor grades has been appeared over here ic1 ic2 ic3 and these are ic1 ic2 ic3 these are the three 
and if I search for manager then it will display manager 1 and manager 2 so IC1, IC2, IC3 those were 3 grades and these are the 3 so total 5 objects we have successfully loaded click on done this is uh, how we can uh, load the business object or more specifically we had seen the uh, grade uh, business object how can we load that one in our HCM cloud and all about this session uh, and if you have any question regarding this please uh, uh, reach out to us at www.bispetrainings.com or www.bispsolutions.com we'll continue in our upcoming session thank you everyone